I'm Phyllis Jackson. Welcome to Stay at Home Connect. The drug dexamethasone is being hailed as a major breakthrough in the fight against coronavirus. Researchers in the UK held clinical trials involving 2,100 COVID-19 patients. They say the inexpensive, widely used steroid reduced death rates by one third among the most critically ill hospitalized patients on ventilators. Researchers stress that among COVID-19 patients requiring no respiratory support, dexamethasone provided no benefits. The FDA revokes the emergency use authorization for hydroxychloroquine and chloroquine. The organization says both medications are unlikely to be effective in treating COVID-19 and have led to serious cardiac adverse events and other major side effects. Music Midtown 2020 has been rescheduled due to the coronavirus. The massive music event will be held September 18th and 19th of 2021. Current ticket holders don't need to worry. Organizers say the tickets will be valid for the new dates. Full refunds are available for those who cannot attend. Before returning to play, kids, coaches, and parents can follow these tips to protect themselves and others from COVID-19. The CDC issues tips on keeping kids safe while participating in sports. Among the recommendations, bring your own equipment and don't share towels or any items you would use to wipe your face or hands. The city of Atlanta designates this week as Cheek Week to spread the word about the need for black and African-American donors to donate bone marrow. Atlanta City Council member Andre Dickens issues a statement regarding Cheek Week, calling it an SOS to the black and African-American community, as well as all from ethnically diverse backgrounds. It reads in part, please step up and help save a life because we are the cure. We have the power within us to help change one more disparity affecting black lives. And it starts with a simple cheek swab. Thanks for joining us. Have a great night.